Good morning, Gulf High. Today is Friday, September 29th, 2017. I'm Caitlin Bluffroad. And I'm Leslie Ann Mojica, coming to you from WBUC Studios with today's Screen News. The word of the day today is interlocutor, someone who participates in a conversation. Could you use that in a sentence, Leslie Ann? Sure, Caitlin. The delusional man wandered down the street, conversing with some invisible interlocutor. Attention all students. School lunches are free until October 20th. The options are limited and will not match up with the online menu. And now to hope with today's weather forecast. Today's weather forecast includes a high of 92 with a low of 77 and a 40% chance of rain. Enjoy the weather, Bucks! Today in History In 1913, Stanley Kramer is born. In 1907, Jean Autry is born. Hey, Leslie Ann, did you know the oldest known octopus fa fossil belongs to an animal that lived 296 million years ago? No, but I do know the joke of the day. What is the world's tallest building? The library, because it has the most stories. 10th grade homecoming shirt sales are today during both lunches. Here's some news we found to be Kinda of strange. Man dressed as Coke bottle robs Kentucky restaurant. A truck spills tons of goo producing eels. Don't forget to pick up your homecoming permission forms. They will be available in the front office and the media. The third annual Pasco County Out of the Darkness Walk will take place on Saturday, October 28th at Swim Sims Park. The Out of the Darkness Walk brings continued suicide prevention efforts to Pasco County. It is a day filled with hope for all those struggling, those that know someone who is struggling, and those who have lost to suicide. Please see Mrs. Han, social worker, located in the front office for more information. Girls and boys soccer conditioning and open soccer will be held from 2 to 30 on October 3rd and 5th. This is open to new and returning athletes. To support students and families affected by Hurricane Irma, the College Board will offer a free November SAT registration and CSS Profile Fee Waiver for students who are experiencing hardships and or displacement due to the hurricane and are in an area designated by FEMA. Students who are registered for the November SAT should call Customer Service to receive a refund of their registration and late fee. For the CSS Profile Fee Waiver, students should go to cssprofile.org and complete their application. For more information, please refer to our scroller. That's all for our news. Have, Have a great Save the, the Koalas Day, Bucks! Day, Bucks.